complete fort in the city. Hello and welcome back to the channel. This is Dipanshi. I love to travel and show you around beautiful places that you can visit. Come be my partner. Let's explore the land of kings today, Rajasthan in India. Kumbhalgarh Fort comes second only to the Great Wall of China. The second greatest wall, the longest wall, is the Kumbhalgarh Fort. Let's go and see what's in store for us. The second greatest wall of the world. So the story goes like this. Once upon a time, King Sampranti. King Sampranti was the grandson of Emperor Ashok. He was traveling across Machinderpur. Machinderpur is a village nearby. And he came across this huge fort which had enormous, gigantic uh, looks. And not only the looks, but it had the potential to be a military camp. So he said, okay, well, why not? use this as a military camp right so uh, along with him the people who were traveling asked king sampranti king sampranti what would you like to name this uh, fort so king sampranti said well this time i don't want to name it um, around my name let's name it around the village which is nearby machinderpur so this got its name from uh, the village which is called Machinderpur and the fort was then called Machindergarh. Now, what happens is that such a huge fort with gargantuan powers is called something so minute. After a lot of years of being set as a military camp, this fort was tired to know that, oh my God, I'm just being used as a military camp. I have so much more potential. Just like a lot of us feel right now, I have so much more potential. Why am I being trapped with COVID? And right, so, so what happened after a lot of years, Rana Kumbha came. Rana Kumbha was a huge figure in the Mewar dynasty. And he said, okay, well, let me revamp it. Let me refurbish it and make this a fortress. What he did, he gave his own name One eternity later to this fort and called it Kumbhalgarh. That's where the name comes from. The Kumbhalgarh wall is around 36 kilometers in length and there are around 360 temples around me and around this fort. Which some of which were built by King Sampranti and some of them were built by Rana Kumbha. It is said that on this path, around four to five horses can walk alongside. One more very interesting fact is that the Great Wall of China has 13 feet thick walls, but this wall is 21 feet thick. And there is a very interesting gate out here, quite Lilliputian. This is a secret door. If in case any enemies try to enter through this gate, the soldiers would exit from this secret gate, go outside and re-enter from behind to attack the enemies once again. Isn't that too interesting? Well, it's a long hike, long one kilometer hike towards the main fort. <laughs> 